Coming back to 922. East Baton Rouge Mayor President Sharon Western Broom and Healthy BR, they're working right now trying to improve access to health care. That can be tricky, so they're launching a survey to assess current health care needs within you know, the community. Now they need you and yep. your help to make sure the right health services get to the right people. Joining us this morning is Healthy BR Executive Director, Dr. Hope Hickerson. Good morning to you. Good morning. Thank you for having me. What a great conversation to have about Ex, uh, expanding access to health care in our community, but yeah. you need to know what services we need. Yes, ma'am. Enter survey. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> the CHNA is so important because it really kind of gives us an idea of where we are health-wise in the community. Um, it shows us, it allows us to see where the gaps are in services. Um, it allows us to kind of get some insight into why some health, health outcomes are different in different parts of the city. So it really just kind of gives us a pulse of what we need to be doing when it comes to health. Um, and it's our hospitals are required to do this every three years, mm -hmm. but we in really encourage that community input um, so they're, they're getting their voice heard, right? Because we may say, you know what, we really need to put energy into, uh, let's say physical health. The community may say, you know, that's great. However, we need some int um, interest in this area as well. So mm -hmm. we really want to listen to the community so we can do what they actually need, not just what we think they want. And we're going to let folks know, we're going to let you guys know how to be a part of this here in a quick second. But when you talk about having done this, again, the hospitals required mm -hmm. to this mm -hmm. over a few years. You guys have done this in the past as well. What are the trends that you guys are seeing as you take sur from survey to survey? Yeah. What are the trends that you're seeing? Well, we're seeing that we know maternal child health is go. an issue that has remained top at the top. Um, HIV and STIs, behavioral health, physical activity, nutrition access, uh, food access, that sort of thing, those kind of always remain at the top. Mm. Um, but then the community will sometimes give us uh, a health need and we're like, oh. An outlier. Right, yeah, right, and we're there. like, oh, we didn't, we didn't know that. But we wouldn't have known that had they not done the survey. Okay, so then let's uh, tell folks how they can access the survey. Right, very easy, just go to healthybr.com. Uh, there's actually, as soon as you go to the website, a pop-up prompt comes up. It's so easy to take. It takes maybe two to three minutes okay. to do. Okay. That's it? So, yeah, really easy. Easy enough. Mm -hmm. Okay, and this is just one of many things that Healthy BR can offer. Yes. You guys actually have so many resources that yes. the community mm -hmm. can take advantage of. Yeah. we Because we don't have a health department here in EBR, we kind of sit in that gap, right? Um, just trying to provide or respond to health needs of the community. So one big thing is our maternal and child health consortium that we do with Family Road and LDH. Um, and we get um, all community organizations, hospitals together, and we try to address the maternal and child health issues. We're actually gonna be launching a campaign called Hear Her Concerns Soon. Mm. Um, really putting, um, giving the women who have experienced issues when it comes to childbirth, reproductive issues, elevating their stories so we can maybe change, perhaps change policies and, and help them in any way that we can. So that's a, a big one that we're doing. We also partnered with the EBR Parish School System um, for the summer feeding program, the summer meals program. Yeah. And we host the map on our website that has all the locations for all of the feeding sites all over the city. It, it really is a, a one-stop shop, not mm -hmm. just for that the survey that we need you to be a part of so that we can know kind of where, what needs what, and where, but also for all the other services. Yes. Can you throw out the website one more time for yes. everybody? HealthyBR.com. Easy enough. Yes. Easy enough. Dr. Hope Hickerson, thank you for coming thank by you. to talk about it. Thank you. Last question, is there a deadline to fill out that survey? Mid-July. There you have it. Do it now. Yes. <laughs>